adventures of Jungle Jim. The adventures of Jungle Jim broadcast weekly over this station are dramatized from the full-color action pictures to be found in the Comic Weekly, the world's greatest comic supplement that comes to you each week with your Hearst Sunday newspaper. Join the 11 million adults and the 6 million youngsters who enjoy the world's best artists featured in every issue of the Comic Weekly, which comes to you with your Hearst Sunday newspaper. Jungle Jim and Bobo, the escape guard, were discovered in the secret underground harbor on Thorson's Island and personally taken captives by Bull Thorson. A single bullet from his automatic ended the career of Bobo, but he is undecided as to what should be done with Jungle Jim. His presence on the island cannot be satisfactorily explained. There are too many loose ends for Thorson to wonder about, so until he can find some answers, Jim will be allowed to live. In the meantime, the schooner bringing Kolo to the island arrives shortly after dawn. His disappointment at not finding Jim at the dock to meet him was very keen. But of even more importance was the fact that the head of the guards gave orders that not one of the crew was to be allowed to set foot on shore an order that Captain Kennedy was obliged to enforce and consequently detain Colo on board. Captain, that be our plan. Tuan Jim want you to let me go on shore. Yes, Colo, I know twas. But you hear the captain of the guards give me the order. And this here being a private island, they could refuse to let me land here anymore for trading purposes. That's my means of making a living, you know. I'm sorry, Colo. It's not your fault, and it certainly ain't mine. If Tuan Jim were free, he would have come down to dock somehow. I have waited one full day. He not come. He not send message. He be in trouble. Colo, no. Well, if he is, it is of his own making, and I don't propose to be a party to it. We ain't leaving here till the day after tomorrow. He's liable to show up yet. If Tuan not come, then what we can do if we wait so long? Nothing. Good Lord, you ain't one to look on the bright side of things, are you, Cole? I thought you fellas from the East believed what is to be will be. And there ain't much we humans can do to change things. Maybe Kolu gets great urge to go on shore to look for Tuan Jim. And Captain, he say no. Then he is the one who tempts the fates, not Kolu. Yeah, I must say there is some sense to that right enough. But uh, while I said you can't go ashore just because that god fella told me to, uh, I didn't exactly tie you up and keep you aboard by force, you know. The captain speak with tongue a very wise man. Now, 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 look here. Don't you go getting ideas about what I say. I ain't told you to go. Of course not, Captain. Well, I'm going to turn in now. Maybe you'd better get some sleep too, eh? Yes, Captain. I go below in a little while. Yeah, yeah, it's such a nice, tarry night for a walk along the beach too. Yeah, too bad, Cole. We can't enjoy one. Now, for goodness sake, stay away from them guards and be careful, will you? Because I hear they can shoot like demons. Thank you. Good night, Captain. Good night, Cole. Good night. With the implied permission of Captain Kennedy, Kolo dove overboard and with a few quick strokes was close enough to shore to pull himself up on the dock. Eluding the single guard placed there, he set out for Thorson's castle up on the hill. But at the entrance to the wall, a double guard was posted. Hey, Vige, the boss, he have catch that man we chased in the woods. How you know? Big Tom, he tell me. Huh. That one, he tell many things. Some of them not true. Oh, this time he be true. Juan, he is God in the house. He tell me he have city man up in the big iron cage. Maybe then he is one we think is spirit. Then Tom be right. It not be some. Only this white man who goes through trees like monkey. Oh, and that is not the only one that bull catch. He find, he find with the white man. 
Bobo. He be so mad to see him. Just one shot. Oh. No more is Bobo. Eh, he's not bad. I don't like that Bobo. In fact, I don't even like his father. The whole family is bad. Sometimes you don't like anything. Do you ever not like yourself? Oh, no. I am a very nice fellow. Hey. Look. What? Here. You see the shadow on the wall? What shadow? You loco. Don't even see wall. You blind. Now he's gone. Wall? No, no. no. The shadow. Don't you just tell me bull put the spirit in cage. Now you see shadows. I know what I see. When I see him. You come with me. I no go no place with no one. This is my post. Here I stay. Shadow want to see me. He come here. Why your father not drown you when you are a baby, huh? I am very pretty baby, that is all. Ah. Hey. What for you make that noise? I told you someone go through the bush right over there. Shh. Quiet. Maybe you're right, Frank. Look. Those leaves move on flood by See. Si. Someone is there. If you go to the right, I will go to the left. We get him. Don't use the gun. We can get him without the shooting. See, si, si, Frank. I go first. Oh! Hey! Hey, hey what Frank! Are you, what do you do? Fall down? No. He must have been in three. Huh? He jumped down on my back. Which hit me on head. Which way? my ankle. Which way he go? Must... Must be that way around the house. Come on. Get up, you cow. Everything you do is wrong. We got to find out who that is. Or get thrown in the guardhouse. I can't walk. You can't walk. No, no, well, run leg. then. My leg. I go. Come on, run. Wait a minute. He not get far away. He get away from you once. You better look at him. Yes. Look like big Indian with tower on head. There is something going up the wall. Give me that gun. He still there? No. He better up down again. Come on. He not get away again. Yes. While Kolo is playing hide and seek with the guards, Bull Thorson finally gets some of the information he wants as he confronts Kitty St. John with Jungle Jim. She breaks down and hysterically blurts out his name. Oh, Jim, they've caught you. So, you knew your husband was alive. Do you think I'd be worrying and grieving for him if I knew it? How can you be so heartless as to say a thing like that? Oh, Jim, why are you tied up? What's the meaning of this, Mr. Thorson? You're a pretty wise doll, Mrs. Bradley, aren't you? But not wise enough to keep that trap of yours shut. I'll have to shut it for you permanently. Now, look here. And that goes for you, too, Mr. Bradley. Pipe down. And if you take my advice, you'll stay that way. We haven't much use for spies here. Hey, Bull. I'd like to talk to you alone for a minute. I've got some unfinished business right here. And you want to waste my time doing something else. Not waste your time, Bull, but this is terribly important. It can't wait another second. All right. Suppose we go into the library. Watch those two, one, and if either one of them makes any kind of a move, shoot. Keep a stiff upper lip, Kitty. This may not be as bad as it looks. Well, it couldn't look much worse. I don't see how it's going to improve. Oh, I'm sick of the whole mess, Jim, and I don't mind saying so. If I had a gun, there's only one person I'd like to use it on, and that's Sasha. I don't like her, and I don't trust her. I hate to hear you say that, Kitty. Because I'd trust her with my very life. I've done so more than once. A truer friend never lived. Do you think it's so smart to talk about such things before the guard? He can't hear us more standing. And besides, I don't see that it makes much difference. Well, what are we going to do? Look, Kitty. These ropes in my hands are just loosely wrapped around my wrists. I can snap them off in an instant. If oh. a reason to do so presents itself. Suppose you try to get the guard up here. Maneuver him between us. Then I can grab that heavy book end from the table and... With a little luck, we'll at least have one rifle and a pistol. It may work. Uh, say, guard. Si, senora. Could you do something for me? What is it? Could you get me a glass of water? There's some medicine I have to take. You not need medicine now. You hear what Bull say. One move, I shoot. Well, don't ask questions anymore. I shoot, too. Well, I must say he's got his guards well disciplined. Some of them look dumb, but they don't act it. There's probably only one thing left to try, Jim. 
What, Kitty? Suppose I would have faint. I think you'd ignore it altogether. I'm going to take a chance. Well, go ahead. Maybe it'll work. Well, be ready, Jim. I won't fall till I'm sure the guard is looking directly at me. Good luck. Why did you insist that I leave them? What can be so important that it must be discussed this instant? Now, Ball, I think you're making a big mistake. About what? They're both spies, and I don't need any further proof. That's not the point. Now, I'm not as sure as you are that they're both spies, but I am sure that they both have information we could use. But they have to be alive to spill it. Well, that Bradley, he's a pretty smooth hombre. I don't think he can be made to talk. I don't mean him, Bull. You could turn on the charm on her and probably find out who they report to and where. While they're here alone on the island, we can control their every action. And we have all to gain and nothing to lose. Don't you see it, Bull? It's a sure thing. I should have plugged that guy the first time I saw him on those stairs. Then I wouldn't have any such decisions as this to make. No, I don't like it, Sasha. Well, what can you lose? I can't say exactly, but I still don't like it. The guy knows too much. He's seen too much. I know all that. But I also know I could go to work on a guy like Bradley and find out the name of his first sweetheart and everything else that he ever knew, and it wouldn't take more than a couple of days. And I don't think that knowing every secret thought they have or possess is worth the chance of letting two people live who are potentially as dangerous to us and our plans as they are. All right. Humor me. Let me try it for 24 hours. All right, it's a deal. And when 24 hours are up, don't ask me for another minute. What happened here? Senor, she's just fell down in a faint. Well, get her some water, a smelling salt, Sasha. See. Si. Bradley. Mrs. Bradley, speak to me. Why, she's out as cold as a mackerel. Well, do what you can for her. Look out. Look out! Who fired the shot? Did Jim succeed in getting the guard's pistol, or did the bullet come from Bull Thorson? Don't miss the next exciting episode in the adventures of Jungle Jim. Remember, you can follow these adventures in the full-color action pictures to be found in the Comic Weekly, the world's greatest comic supplement containing the best full-color adventures and comic pictures. Remember, no other comic supplement can give you the top names of cartoon land like the all-star favorites to be found in the Comic Weekly. The whole family follow the fun and frolics of Jiggs and Maggie, the Little King, the immortal Donald Duck, as well as the exciting adventures of Jungle Jim and Flash Gordon. Join the 11 million adults and the 6 million youngsters who every week find the greatest of home entertainment in the Comic Weekly, which comes to you with your Hearst Sunday newspaper. Music